One of the great things about the Pilates repertoire is just how much developmental movement and nervous system regulation is baked into the work. I'm actually going to show you a sequence today where I add a little bit, I tweak a little bit about it to make it even more supportive of the nervous system regulation. We're going to add in some eye movements and we're going to choose to do contralateral movements at the beginning and the end and then in the middle explore some same sided and homologous, both arms or both legs, so that we can really move through those sequences that nourish the nervous system. So I'm just using light yellow springs on a springboard. You could also do this off the end of a trap table. And starting with the opposite arm and leg, nice and easy. And this gives the brain and the body a chance to integrate that oppositional contralateral movement is so important for that. I'm gonna pause for a moment and then go into same sided movements. Same sided often won't feel as natural and that's okay, it's good for our nervous system to have that novel and sometimes challenging experience. Now, if you want to take this further, you could go out and use the spring to assist you in lifting the arm. Nice and gentle. That can add a little active assisted range of motion into the movement. And then I'm going to go back to the oppositional movement. So just taking a bit of creative license here and again, adding in the developmental movements and nervous system support. And then going into just pushing both arms out. Now staying static in the legs, just the arms moving for that homologous movement, really important. Keep the movement going, taking the eyes, just the eyes. Keep the head still in the center. Take the eyes side to side. Going deeper into that nervous system. And we just do a bit of this because it does go so deep. And then finishing with the oppositional contralateral movement once again nice and easy and if you wanted to add another visual component keep the head still take the eyes to the ceiling and to the floor so maybe start with just the pattern of movements and add in the eyes later it's a great way to work on integrating your nervous system while also being upright against gravity having a little resistance and then for that one variation, having a little assistance into shoulder flexion. I hope you found this helpful.